We first introduced you to a man named Steve Larson about a month ago. Steve has ALS, more commonly known as Lou Gehrig's disease. It's a disease that gradually takes over your body, and it's fatal. Today we went back to the nursing home where Steve is staying and spoke about Christmas, about the new year, about defying the odds, and about making each and every day count. The biggest thing I've noticed is uh, muscle weakness in my neck. And that really creates a lot of problems. I want to sit up every day, you know, and uh, I, I can feel that going pretty fast. Since our last visit, ALS has crept further into Larson's already frail body. But when the going gets tough, Steve Larson, well, he adapts. A lot of, a lot of bumps in the road that you have to, I have to change my routine for. Change, the only thing that's constant in life, suggests Larson, the holiday season. That's changed for him as well. It gets a little lonely like on Christmas Day or something, you know, when you know everybody else is having fun and, you know, you're here alone. Steve talks about the loneliness during the holidays, but doesn't stay down for long. You can mope around if you want to and be miserable every day, but, you know, what good is that going to do you? Surrounding him in his room, photos of his family, his dog Crusher, who visits faithfully every day for a couple hours, and Christmas cards. Cards like these. It says Merry Christmas, Steve. I guess we'll have a snowy Christmas. We had a good blizzard in November. Uh, let's see, couldn't even open our door for three days. The snow was up to the door latch, what a mess. It says I was completely snowed in. And uh, this is my aunt who had uh, polio when she was young. And she's handicapped and she's doing really well. And I miss her. We move on to New Year's and resolutions. And Steve says live for today, not for a date on the calendar. You know, if you, if you notice you're doing something wrong in your life and if you have to wait till New Year's Eve to change it, it's probably not going to work. <laughs> in short, live your best life and live it now. We should tell you, we'll continue to bring you periodic updates on Steve Larson and his condition and his advice on living your best life.